guys, big news today. Google just dropped a bombshell, a new open source model called Gemma 3. Despite its compact 27 billion parameters, it's outperforming models like DeepSeek with over 600 billion parameters. What's even more astonishing is that it can run locally on a single graphics card. Is this a case of David beating Goliath in the AI world? Or is Google up to some cutting edge tech again? Today, we'll test it out to show you just how powerful Gemma 3 is. Plus, we'll guide you on how to install it on your own computer. Let's dive right in. First, let's look at the hard data. On the latest chatbot arena ELO rankings, Gemma 3's 27 to B medium model scored 1,338 points, directly surpassing DeepSeek V3's 671 B model, 1,318 points, and OpenAI's mini model, 1,304 points. Even more impressive, it's only 25 points behind Google's own 671 billion full strength DeepSeek R1. And the kicker, it achieves this at just 1 25th the size of its competitors. Imagine this, other AI models require 8 pre-H100 GPUs to run, while Gemma 3 needs just a single graphics card you might already have. It's like a bicycle reaching bullet train speeds. So why is Gemma 3 so formidable? Google has introduced three major innovations. Gemma 3 enhances contextual understanding with support for up to 128K text extensions. This means it can handle tasks like code writing, document summarization, and complex conversations with ease. Except for the 1B entry-level version, the entire series supports mixed input of images, videos, and text. Future updates may include voice or visual interactions, making Gemma 3 excel in tasks like Q&A, image analysis, code assistance, and text summarization. It breaks language barriers by supporting over 140 languages, enabling more natural interactions with users worldwide and expanding its range of applications. How to use it. Next, we'll walk you through installing Gemma 3 locally. Detailed links are provided in the description below, so follow along closely. Step one, download the latest version of Olama. Visit the Olama website to download the client. Even if you have Olama installed, you'll need to reinstall the latest version to support Gemma 3's local operation. On the site, you'll see supported models like Llama 3.3, DeepSeek R1, and Gemma 3. Click the download button, and once it's complete, double click to install. If the Alama icon appears in your system tray, the installation was successful. Step two, download the model file, return to your desktop and open the search bar in the bottom left corner. Type CMD and click on command prompt. Don't be intimidated. You'll only need to enter one of the following four commands corresponding to different versions of Gemma 3, 1B, 4B, 12B, or 27B. If your computer has six to 12 gigabytes of VRAM, we recommend the 4B or 12B versions. For high-performance PCs with over 16 gigabytes of VRAM, you can try the 27B version. Note that the 1B model doesn't support multimodal functions. For this guide, we'll use the 12B model. The command is provided in the video description. If you need a different model, visit Alama's website, click on Models, select your desired model, and you'll find the corresponding command. Back in the command prompt window, paste the copied command and press an enter. The system will automatically download the 12B model of Gemma 3, which is about eight gigabytes. So please be patient. Step three, install extension plugins. Once the model download is complete, you can use it directly by entering prompts like, who are you? Please introduce yourself and it will respond. However, using the command line can be inconvenient for internet access and file uploads. Therefore, we'll use a Google Chrome browser extension. The link is also provided below. Click to add it. After adding, it will automatically invoke the local Gemma 3 model. If you have other models, you can switch between them in the top left corner. To enable internet access, toggle the switch at the bottom. You can also click the settings button in the top right corner to switch languages and select desired features. Scroll down to search engine. Switch it to Google and click Save at the bottom to enable more comprehensive searches. Testing Gemma 3. Now let's test Gemma 3's capabilities. Comparing 6.11 and 6.9.
This classic problem is correctly answered by Gemma 3, though it lacks a detailed reasoning process. Nonetheless, it's already outperforming many standard models. Medical Assistant We found an X-ray image of a patient with a lung infection online and sent it to Gemma 3 to see if it could identify the issue. It promptly recognized the problem and provided some advice. However, remember that such AI suggestions are for reference only. Consult a medical professional for accurate diagnosis. Video Analysis we sent Gemma 3 a video link and asked for content analysis and optimization suggestions. In this test, Gemma 3 took a long time to analyze the video and provided content unrelated to the actual video, indicating room for improvement in this area. Regardless, Google's open source release has significantly lowered the cost of using AI. Whether you're a student, designer, doctor, or content creator, a single graphics card plus Gemma 3 unlocks limitless possibilities. That concludes today's video. If you have further questions, feel free to discuss them in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. See you next time.